Hello everyone, this is going to be our setup and intro video for the Mars Box, or Hollis Mars Box 2022. This is going to have the uh, Mars Box, our Mars TV apps on it. So what you're going to do when you get your box, you get out of the package. Underneath here you have your um, HDMI cable, remote, and power cord, which we already have. The only thing that's not provided is an Ethernet cable. You're going to get a remote like this. It will need two AAA batteries. Then you're gonna just gonna, once you get it, you're gonna plug it in. Uh, obviously I have an ethernet cord. You would have to buy that or connect it wirelessly. I'm just gonna take it, get HDMI, ethernet, and then power cable if you have it. And the box is gonna boot up. I'll back up here so you guys can see. Now we're going to go through the basic setup of it, of what it's going to be like when you get a box from us. And then once we're finished with that, um, I'm just going to show a couple basic things because I always have people ask what they can get with the box. So once your box boots up, it'll bring you into a screen like this. You are going to first, before you do anything, you're going to go down here to the settings gear. Then obviously I have mine plugged in through Ethernet. If you do not, you're going to click on network and internet. Then you're going to turn the Wi-Fi on. You're going to select your Wi-Fi, type in your password, and get that connected. And once your Wi-Fi is connected, you're going to go back. Oh, sorry, I went too far. Then you're going to go right here to device, device preferences. Then you go to your date and time. And you're gonna make sure leave it as automatic and then go right here to set time zone as you see mine specific i'm in eastern so you would go down and change that to eastern and it's gonna automatically set your time and date for you once your internet's connected then you're gonna go back out of that then you're gonna go right here to display then in display you're right here to this first screen percent right here the one under hdmi click that and basically you're gonna click your left arrow key to go in you can see how now you got the black run that out till it touches same thing with the top and bottom, bring it in and then out until it touches. Then you hit your back button, back button again, back button again, back button again. Then we will, your box will be ready to go as long as your internet's connected. Um, so some things you get with this box, here's your replay section. So how this is going to work is any channel that is listed in here <clears throat> on your left side will be channels eligible for replay. So let's just say we want to do discovery. Then you're going to go over here and pick which day. It runs for seven days. So let's just say we want to go back to Monday the 18th. Then you're going to go down through and find your time slot. Obviously, my times are going to be off right now because, like I said, I still have mine set in Pacific. Then you'll find it, click OK on it, and it'll load up and play. Sometimes you might catch the tail end of the show that was on before it. And so we would catch, you know, the tail end of Bad Chad Customs. And then what you would have to do is you're going to miss the end of the America's List. Then you would have to go to the episode below it. And then you could watch the first episode of that. And it'll show you the end of the episode you're watching. So that pretty much sums up the replay section. And I'm sorry, I'm going to run through this kind of quick so we can show the whole thing and I have a long video. Hit your back button twice and then get back to here. VOD or Video On Demand is what VOD stands for. This is going to have your TV series, movies, um, current running TV series on TV. So once it loads up, all that will populate pictures. Then you could go here to search. You could search for something by name. So say you watch Chicago PD, you can go C-H-I-C -C and then stop. And you can get down here and go search. But as you see, it's going to bring up a C-H-I-C -C in it. So, like, so there you got the end, Chicago PD. Uh, let's see, there's Chicago Fire, Chicago Med, anything with the CHIC in it. Obviously, the more you type, the smaller your search window is going to get. Um, same thing with movies. Um, if you favorite anything, so let's just say Jurassic World, if you want to favorite it, you would just click OK on there, and that will put it in this favorites list here on the left. History will be anything you watched. Newest is the newest stuff they put on the box, not always the newest stuff out. 
Movies is obviously all your movies. Then when you go down here and click movies, you can search, you can filter them, you can look by category. Um, I think when you under filter, you can look by year. Um, like I said, it's pretty open to what you want to look for. Uh, TV series, same thing. <clears throat> you can go in here and click that. Find what TV series you want to watch. Like I said, anything that's running on TV right now is on here. Go through and find it, uh, favorite it, and then when it's shown on TV, just like Master Chef. So if Master Chef airs on, we'll say Monday nights or whatever night it airs, Tuesday morning that episode will be on here to watch. There's also previous seasons on here, as you can see. Uh, see, so that gives everybody a rough idea there how that works. Um, same way with like Law and Order. So obviously Law and Order, there's all your. It's just got the newest season right now. And as you can see, there's plenty of that. So let's go back and we'll go live TV. Like I said, this is just a quick uh, run through. Um, if you have any questions, you know, feel free to reach out to us. I'm just trying to run through this. That way no one has to watch a 20 minute video to get the understanding of all this. So as you see, when it comes up, you look at the bottom, okay for a channel list, up and down the change channel, left the search, right for resources. So what that means is if you hit left, you can search for a channel by name. So let's just say B, there's BET, Bravo, Bloomberg, um, same concept of anything. If you want to watch golf, you can type in golf, find the golf channel. Uh, if you want to find ESPNs, you want to type ESP, and there's all kinds of ESPNs. Um, if you want to watch, let's say you want to read the God. So you hit your OK button, there's your God. Left arrow key, you can go over and actually separate it down a little bit. So, like, you can build a favorite set, your network, regional, which is like your news station, they say ABC, Baltimore, so on. Your sports networks, 24-7 channels, pay-per-view events, which I'll come back to, NBA for basketball, MLB for baseball, NFL, NCAA football, NCAA basketball, NHL, there's some music channels. VIP is going to be your adult section. If you hit OK on that, you have to have a password. I can get you the password if needed. Um, Latino, Supersport, Canada, Philippines, UK, and others. Obviously, all these are channels with other languages. So let's say someone always asks, you know, where would I find this? Where would I find that? If network TV is usually where you're going to find most regular TV channels. Once you're here, if you hit your right arrow key, that's going to show you what's on the channel. Then you can scroll down to your next channel, your next channel, so on, and it'll show you what's on in the time slots. Obviously, like I said, my time slots are off because I didn't set my time zone, and it's like that the whole way down. So once you're on the channel, you want to see what's on, hit the right arrow key. You see what's on, it gives you a description at your left arrow key, then you scroll down more. If you want to favorite a channel while you're highlighted on it, hold your OK button down to the star lights up. That's going to favorite your channel. And then what will happen is then up here in your favorites list, as you see one channel, that's the one we favorited. So if you want to take it out, hold OK, and then you get back. Favorites, zero, gone. Um... So I have a lot of people do that. That way you don't have to look at all the channels. Pay-per-view stuff. Everybody's always asked me, what's on the box for pay-per-view? All right. This is how pay-per-view set up. So all these top channels here, as you see, all MMA, wrestling, MMA, wrestling. You got some blank extras. And I know it looks weird. We got to keep scrolling. There's some ESPN pluses. And then once you get below that, below the ESPN pluses, We have race channels. So what these are are going to be dirt track racing. Could be some asphalt. But it's usually going to be your stuff like flow racing, dirt vision. So there's race one, two, three. I think there's 15 race channels. And that's that. So the 15 channels designated for racing. As you can see, they list stuff on here so you can find it. If you let it scroll, <clears throat> this ain't going to have the option. Actually, I lot it does. But see, it's going to say loading failed. But you can see up top it says weekly racing from Knoxville Saturday the the 23rd 
or if you sit over here on it and wait and let it scroll, it'll tell you the same thing. Um, and it'll give you a date and everything like that. And you can favorite these channels as well. That way you don't scroll through all them pay-per-view channels. So you can favorite the 15 race channels. Um, I'm not going to, I have pay-per-view is not guaranteed. That is not something I can guarantee. So any of that stuff from that pay-per-view section, I can't guarantee. I can tell you, you're going to have access to regular TV. You have access to VOD, uh, things like that. Um, we do have a group on Facebook, uh, DNS Mars box sales slash support. Um, I don't do any programming support, but I do support as far as helping with your box. If you're having issues like that, um, and we can get you referred to the right people. If you want a price on buying one of these, please join our group. Um, I can't list the price out on here because of agreements I've made with people I sell for. I'm not allowed to do that. But again, you can reach out to us. We will get you a price. We ship all over the U.S. Uh, we ship outside the U.S. We ship the military. And I think that about sums that up. Um, I will put my phone number in the group name down in the comments of this video. So that way if you don't have Facebook, you can text us. Just please be understanding I am on the East Coast. If you're on the West Coast and uh, it's 9 at night and you message me, it's midnight here. Um, I do work full time, so please bear with me with that. Um, that sums everything up for us, guys. If uh, you want to learn more about this box, like I said, feel free to uh, send us a message, get some pricing info, uh, learn how to buy wholesale from us and things like that. Thank you. Have a good day.